see here are different levels of a communication through mathematics. We've seen binary code, we've seen braille, and we have seen horse code even. Here come the farmers, early August, to mow down the field. And every year, no matter what the crop circles are, the farmers have to make their money. So they go and they mow out the field. And some of the smarter farmers have actually made crop circle bread and crop circle beer. So yeah, pretty cool. From the ground, you can see very different than from the air. There's your pie. And as you look at it, you're kind of, you see like, you know, the, the overall picture, but you don't realize the incredible, intricate artwork on the inside. So these two, interestingly enough, were across the road from each other, looking similar. And when you put them on top of each other, some people considered it the Shroud of Turin. Thanks for the watermark. Pretty cool, huh? That they spread them out, so you have to figure it out and put them together. Ooh, I'm talking Canadian. <laughs> I love saying out. <laughs> so here's a triple Julia set. And that Julia set, a single of the two, we saw at Stonehenge. And what I was needing to tell you was that a pilot with a scientist flew across Stonehenge to do some exploring, mathematics, photos, and uh, the field was empty. And the pilot knows his course. He goes out, he comes back the same course. Within 20 minutes, they finished their work, turned around and came back, and the Julia set a single of those that we saw in the picture at Stonehenge was in the field. Huge, acres. I had a friend, Patricia Corey, that went and took her group because they were at Stonehenge and they heard there's a crop circle. And you can imagine thousands of people running across <coughs> the road to get into this crop circle. And she said she and her group sat in one of the circles and started to laugh. And she said, my entire group laughed for three hours. <coughs> Wish I was at that party. <laughs> Somebody asked for the 409 circles? So this is one. It happened in pouring rain. Absolutely rainy night where you could, I feel like I'm losing the bottom of the screen. Are you seeing, we're missing some of the screen, I don't know why, sorry. But there's 409 circles in there, and on a rainy night, when humans go in, of course there'd be mud everywhere if it was made by people with boards and ropes. The first people in the field said there was no evidence of human interaction anywhere. There was no mud on any of the stalk in that crop circle. And that's one where you walk and you go, oh, what a great circle, oh, there's another one, oh, there's another one. You can go on for days and not know where you are in that formation. Very impressive. 